Here is a quick recipe for gluten free crispy crepe made out of chickpea flour. This is a healthy recipe that can be served for breakfast or for a snack. It's uh, much more healthier than the regular wheat flour and it doesn't need much of ingredients. So to start off we just need chickpea flour, some water and a few spices. So you add some salt, red chili powder and some garam masala. Just mix all the ingredients and then add some water and whisk it well with either an electronic blender or with a hand whisker. Once you see that the mixture is uh, nice and smooth, it's ready to be put on the pan. So I'm going to be making it without the vegetables first and then with the vegetables. So this is the plain crepe that you're seeing now. Just put one ladle of the mixture onto the heated pan. I usually use a non-stick pan just so I don't have to use much of oil but chickpea flour is such that it will not stick to any surface. You can even make it on a pan which is not a non-stick. However, for that you would need a little bit more oil, maybe a few more drops than what I would use on a non-stick pan. As you see, I've just put a couple of drops of oil and it's come out so quick and easy. So I turn it around in about 30 to 45 seconds and this is the plain one will come out to be really crispy uh, and I'm serving it with the sweet and sour tomato chutney and the hot coriander chutney. You can find the recipes for these chutneys on my website. Now the second one you're seeing here is with all the vegetables. So whatever I had handy, I'm putting it in. It's green peppers, onions, tomatoes, green chilies and uh, ginger. So I will mix all of this and then the mixture is ready to be put on the pan the same way. I'm putting it onto a non-stick pan and just one ladle is good enough. Um, and about 35 to 40 seconds it's ready and crisp. Uh, you can add a few drops of oil again. Uh, oil makes it a little bit more moist and soft but you may choose not to put any oil. Um, so once the oil is put about 10 seconds or so you wait for the oil to seep in and then turn the crepe around and it's ready to serve. As I said earlier you can be as creative as you want to be with this. You can add any vegetables that you have handy or non-vegetarian uh, people can even add some meats or sausages. Um, even in the dough in the mixture you could add some meats or cheese cottage cheese so the options are numerous and you just have to be creative to get this uh, nice and yummy try this out the healthy recipe for a chickpea flour crepe